In this game, we're going to implement a very simple scoring system. So you'll see right now that if I'm playing the game, when I um, hit the astronaut or when I have a collision with the astronaut object, then it moves the astronaut object. Well, we're going to do two things. One is we're going to set up this variable, which is actually already built into it, called score. And then we're going to tell it when to change that. And then we're going to show that on the screen. So let's do it in that order. So we don't have to actually declare this variable because it already exists. And it actually shows up in the things that you can do, but I'm just using it as a variable rather than using the score functionality because I couldn't get that to work. You might be able to get it to work, but if you do have problems, do it the way that I'm doing it. So first things first, when the player is created here, I've got it doing assigning a variable for player speed. Now you may or may not do that. That really isn't important. But what we're going to do is we're going to set, um, set this thing called score. Now if you look, you'll see this built-in variable. So it's already there. So we're going to say when the level starts, your score is going to be zero. Now you might choose to do this across different levels and not have it starting at zero, but I'm starting it at zero. So we've started at zero. Well, when we collide with an astronaut, we make the astronaut jump to another point. Well, that's all well and good, but what we're also going to do is we're going to put in this variable, again, built-in variable for score, and we're going to make it go up by one. So we've actually done the first two parts of our scoring system. It's pretty easy. It starts at zero. Every time we collide with an astronaut, the score goes up. Well, let's see this score. So I've already got this object called player. Uh, and it's visible at the moment, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a draw event, which will make it invisible. And I'm going to tell it that I want to draw, and I'm going to draw a value. And up here for the caption, I'm going to put score, or points or something. I think I'll just put score. And then down here, I'm going to type score, which you'll again see is that built-in value. And I'm just going to have it out from the edge of the screen at 10 and 10, although I've written that as 19 and 19, but it doesn't particularly matter. And now we should have those things working, but let's see if they all work. So there's the score at zero. That's encouraging. There we go. So every time I hit it, the score is increased by one. You could have it increasing by a greater amount. And that value is shown up in the spot where I asked the draw event to do it. So there you go. There's a simple scoring system for you.